I'm not exactly sure what you're describing exactly means for Rand. And hey, we're back. Well, it's not something that it's it's you know that consistent with everything that you've seen so far in this area. The fact that it's different is probably relevant in some way, but you're not 100% sure how. Uh, okay, so what was your Arcana check, please? Uh, 16. 16. The average. Okay. Let's see. I'm, and I'm really looking for like what looks magical in general out across the whole room. But right. Uh, okay. Now, how thorough is your search of the pews? You just like doing cursory glances, and you actually like touching them. Ran. Yeah. Oh, me. Yeah. Mostly, I'm looking for... Actually, it's a cursory view of the pews. I'm looking... Since you relate it to a uh, church, I'm looking more at, like, if there's any books or anything around. Okay, I got you. Yeah. We will um, cover that here in just a moment. Um, Leas. Yeah. The, old, the, the centerpiece of the chapel, which is the altar there, is a block of strange material that glows with an inner light of opalescent blue. That's the magical color. Okay. Hey, Miss Prison. Not worried about too much of that. Okay. Anybody comment on There this? is. This is actually relevant. I should have mentioned this earlier. On the opposite corner from where you came in, uh, to the far right of the room as you're kind of looking. As we walked in. As, as you walked in. There's another archway that has the mists, the obscuring mists that can penetrate any sort of vision. That's uncomfortable. Bless you. Thank you. Is that... Would that... Uh, all seeing gem have been active still when we walked into this room. Do what? The, the yeah, true yeah. seeing gem would that have been active when we still walked um, into this room? Um, it's it's active for ten minutes. That's so, why I asked. Yeah. I mean, it's it's on the line of where I, I see that. I would say that it it would still be active, but it would also it would fade after this room. Yeah. He's done a lot since since yeah. then. Uh, well as then, as, like, in that case, in, in getting everything, do I uh, see anything in the room with that? Uh, okay, that's a great question. There is nothing like secret or invisible or anything like that in here. Okay. Uh, Rand. Yes. And this, there won't be any way to particularly hide this. Um, the hinged seats. Because, like, you're searching the pews and stuff, and, like, the sort of back pews as you're searching them, right, you start finding silver pieces. Okay. Like, in the pews. A lot of silver pieces. And I'm... Rain he's picking every gonna pick, yeah, up. He's going to pick them all up. But to save time here, uh, you you do a thorough search here while, like, Leos is looking over everything else, and while... Soren and Kyron are probably also looking around and just kind of prepared for any sort of combat or something. Like you yeah. all are just ready for us to fuck up. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> uh, <laughs> remember, I have the alert feed, so like I'm uh, you will see, see or, yeah, you scared. find like, well, this is treasure ready. you find in this room. I just assume you're gonna fuck up. So um, it's not really an alert feed. It's a it's four thousand silver pieces. Shit, four thousand per. Uh, let's see. Each hidden there and so 
Hey, hang on, actually, because it's on both sides. You have two, three. Okay. You end up finding this is a shit ton of treasure here. Uh, it's gonna be good, actually. It's gonna be about the same thing. So fourteen hundred uh, plus oh. four thousand. That was a crack in a pop right there. Okay, total, because you find some like silver pieces and electro pieces and all that stuff. But all told, uh, you end up finding a total value of coins equal to 3,400 gold. Nice. Okay. I can dig Just that. Just the better. For once, Rand is the one making that profit. Yeah. yeah. I've been digging off my phone too much. <laughs> Thanks, sir. There is, as as you move forward, there is a skeleton. Put it in two. Two. Uh, yeah. One is one amp, two is two amps. Uh, yeah, okay. Most that's folks fair. want two amps nowadays. Okay. As you move further into the room. It's kind of old, but I'll take it anyway. You can see the features in the south end, like the altar means. and everything. Uh, the chair, that's kind of by the altar. The chair is nicely carved and padded, but seems unremarkable. On either side of the dais are large freestanding brass candelabras, each holding five white candles. In each corner on the southern wall is a large white pottery urn, stoppered with a brass and wood plug. Sprawled on the floor near the west wall <coughs> is a human skeleton in black chainmail that is badly rusted and damaged. So not a skeleton's outstretched arm points to a stone archway set in the wall. The, the opening is filled with opaque, bright orange vapors. Ah, this, that's one of, that was the left color <coughs> of that archway I saw before. I have a feeling that maybe if I were to touch one of those colors, it would take me to one or three places. No, like... This may be one of them. The v oh. I gotcha. At the, the vapors, original, at, yeah, at the original one, it had a milky white vapor, and then you described three colors up top. One of them was orange, I think, on mm -hmm. the left. Right. Maybe if I were to touch that and walk through, it would have taken me right here. Uh, Possibly. As you approach the this particular archway, right, mm -hmm. none of the stones around it glow. Yeah. Like the one previously. previously. But that, that previous one was like at the entrance, and now we've delved a, a little short ways into the rabbit hole and found one that matched. Anyway, uh, that's, I don't know. Should I do another arcana check on that door? Uh, sure you can. Do you even have detect magic? Nope. Not something I would use. I have like literally all attack and spells. Gotcha. Uh, you did roll a natural twenty. I rolled a natural twenty on my arcana check. Plus six is twenty six. Very nice. Uh you're a sorcerer. Sorcerer. Right? Okay, so So I draw magic um, in the air. You I'm still not really that sure. Really good. You can tell that this archway, right, is transmutation magic. Oh fuck, that's even scarier. <laughs> not, not transportation. Not teleportation. Yeah, but transmutation. That's not <clears throat> yeah. settling. And again, don't know what it does. Yep, I I literally like guys. Transmutation. Don't touch that door. You might turn into a frog. Say less now. That, oh yeah, no. Immediately, as soon as I figured it out, I was like, guys, this is transmutation magic. Fuck off the door. Don't touch it. Fuck off the door. Yeah. <laughs> like, I, I literally freak out enough that I yeah. can't even speak right. Just like, just fuck off the door. Okay. 
What do you do next? Uh, so the altar you said was all magic-y and blue, right? Yes. I want to take a closer look into that. Okay. How are you going to inspect? I mean, I'm pretty garbage at investigation. I'm going to tell Rand to investigate it, but... Okay. Rand, do you want to investigate the altar? Yeah. Um, yeah, sure. I've made all the... You made you, 3 I was about gold. to say, Rand isn't You're really literally spending concerned much time. about money, but he's like, oh, shit, there's a bunch of fucking silver in here. All right, so then how, he goes, how are you investigating that? Visually? First, he uses Mage Hand to just kind of touch, just to see. Poke around. Okay. Yeah, and then he actually Mage does Mage Hand it. has, like, no effect to the, like, no effect to the altar. And then he just does a physical inspection of it. Like, looking. Yeah. And all that. Okay. Investigation check. And if there's anything of value on there... You're taking that too. I, I want... Yes. He okay. will be at least... We're He'll not be. taking it. I just want to know what items of value might be on there. I got gotcha. you. So you're kind of... Um, Inspecting. Gotcha. Praising. Um, that's the word I was Give me a first thing we're gonna do is investigation. Which we're using a lot of. Hey, it's one more, twenty-four. He rolled an eleven. No, that's twenty uh investigation. Five. 20, 24. Twenty-four, no, you're right, yeah. Yeah, you have a twenty-three. You remember my stats more than Okay. It's, I do. It, it's you it's two things that you do every single ten seconds. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> like, that's fair. Now the next thing I need you to do is roll a dexterity saving throw. Again, something I'm good at. This is... And that's a 19, so that's a 29. Oh, Fucking yeah. A. Nice. You do a backflip off of that shit. Have I ever rolled Excellent. like Do you have evasion? Like no. This? Do you have evasion? Yes. Yeah. Then you will take no. the damage from the lightning bolt that shoots out it of the altar. It blasts out of it. Good. So I'm looking at that. It streaks, it streaks down the center of the... The aisle. The aisle. And normally it would kind of branch out, uh, attract it to all the coins and stuff. And uh, wreck everything. you all the coins. I have acquired the coins. The coins are all in your pocket. You're good. <laughs> now, another thing that happens as you're you know, physically inspecting this is that the color of the altar changes to a fiery <coughs> red. Interesting. Yeah, like when you touch it as you're doing your investigation, when you touch it, right. the lightning bolt streaks out. And then the color of the altar changes. From what to what? From just a blue to a uh, fiery bluish red. So from and blue to a fiery kind of, blue. Kind of looks at, and shimmers almost like uh, fire. Okay. Um, really don't know what to do. Uh, yeah. Except freeze in place. So can I take a, uh, I mean, another arcana check on what the hell just fucking happened to that thing? Uh, yeah. You can certainly try. Yay. Uh, 22. 22, okay. While you're not 100% sure, because this is all like crazy weird stuff that you've never really seen <laughs> yeah. before. Um, it seems as though the spell that's tied into the altar has shifted away from lightning bolt or something else. Because that's a pretty good roll. Yeah. Went to. So, you don't know, again, you don't know what it went to <coughs> based on the uh, new colors and everything. Fiery. Probably do something to do with fire. Um, but, it, yeah. it's still, do I get the notion that it's still, like, armed and ready? Mm -hmm. Do I? Yes. Oh, there's, there's still a crap ton of magic flowing through it, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. On the 
eastern side by the skeletal man. By the way. Um, no, I'm sorry. The uh, skeletal man is by the portal. Um, on the eastern side, opposite of the archway, there is a. That is, of course, closed. Did I see anything with it when we walked in with that all-seeing eye? <coughs> uh, <coughs> no. Oh, so okay. bitch. As a matter of fact, you can kind of tell when looking through it that uh, it's pretty normal. It is. It's impregnated with some very strong anti-magic. Okay. That prevents. Uh, like changing its substance or removing like basically it. Basically the earth bending kind of thing. Right. You can't just move it out of the way. Yeah, it's it's really reinforced, magically and physically. <clears throat> Neat. Okay. Um perception check if you're looking at that. It's really the only thing that's left. I would say, maybe we should uh, all make that. On the altar, by the way, yeah. you had kind of a best Yeah. There isn't anything on the altar. Okay. Was that all you were going to say? Yeah. All right, okay, perception check, everyone, please. <clears throat> there's, there's like nothing on <clears throat> the altar. There's nothing on the chair or anything like that. 24. 10 plus, call it a 10, so 20. Not that. 24. 24. 24. Not that. <laughs> I got a 14. I got less than that. Yeah. All right. Soren. Yes. Um, looking over, because everyone kind of, at this point, because there isn't really So we're all else. looking over the entire room. Yeah. Um, the eastern wall near the uh, stone gate you see a, a small slot with the letter O faintly traced above it. Okay. Let's see here. <clears throat> the wall slot is of sufficient size to accept a coin or a disc-shaped gem. It is also just right for the insertion of a magic ring of any sort. Told you. Uh, so probably like 3,000 gold or silver coins. I guess that's like 30,000 silver coins. Or one of those rings. Or maybe that, that one, one ring, gem that we got. That one ring. It can also accept coins, because, I mean, you haven't tried anything yet. All right, so let's try <laughs> one of those silver coins you picked up. Wait, and it requires a magic ring? A silver no, coin. it's like big enough. No, like, the slot is of sufficient size to accept a coin, disc shaped gem, or the insertion of a magic so we Which is literally the two magic items we found and the third item we just found a bunch of coins in this room. Try a coin to that, because that's a lot. I mean, I have this red ring that I've been keeping since like three dungeons ago. What is it? Oh, that was that oh, was in Ganrock. It was. What is it? It's just a red ring. Literally, that gave yeah. it, even... it sucked fire to me, that's yeah. all I know. It was something we used for a, a key. I, have I just kept it as a momentum. Okay. It's magic has been yeah, no. uh, expanded. Yeah. Oh, I know it has. Yeah. It doesn't mean we can't try it. Yeah. <laughs> it won't work, but it's funny. I mean... Nah, I like it. I actually like having the red ring. You don't know, so it's, yeah, it's cool. I'm keeping my red ring. So, try a silver piece that you found in here. 
one of the pieces that was in here. One silver. Do you need me to give you a silver? If you want to do a silver, put a silver No, put salt. one that was in here through that. Rand walks up. <laughs> the it does mate. a glare <laughs> the at Leas and pops one of his silver that he picked up in the chapel. Not the chapel. The, the, the room. Yeah. In the slot. Nothing happens? I'm um, looking into oh, okay. that now. <laughs> <laughs> um, Fiery munchies are my favorite one. Hmm? The fiery munchies. Oh, okay, yeah. That I will. I uh, sun chips. That will open the door, the gate, right? So when you put the the coin in, um, the 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 stone gate block will begin to sink slowly into the floor, so as to allow entry into the passage beyond. Um, the object into the slot is forever lost as the sinking stone crushes all to pieces. Aren't you glad we didn't put the ring in yeah, there? Yeah, I'm not saying good thing it was just a silver. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yep. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Alright, now. Beyond the gate stone, the corridor widens to ten feet and turns southward, where steps lead down steeply to a corridor that goes west. Each of the three doors in the corridor. Uh, which I will show you now. Alright. So where are we? In the chapel. That's we what, went out the door to the um, right. Yes. Alright. So this is where you went into the altar right here. Yes. Yeah. And then this is that orange mist... Uh, teleportation, teleportation, transmutation, room. motherfucker, you up. Transmutation room. This is the stone gates that yeah. that down. Where we just opened. and you kind of walk in, and there's the stairs leading down and leading to the three doors. Okay. See it, Alex. Yeah, I got it. Okay. We got another three doors. Great. Uh, investigation. Doors. I ain't doing the first. Well, I can do the investigation, but I ain't opening another one. Fine. I investigate the doors. Uh, that's what I'm looking at now. Alright. With <laughs> their minimum 23. Hmm. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. That's fucking awesome. I'm about to say, Rain, why... might, Rain screws up at a lot of shit. But there's some but stuff you're really good well, at. Yeah. <laughs> there's some stuff you're really good So, at. roll your investigation. Uh, oh, nice. Uh, uh, 17 plus 13. 13. Mm, yeah, so, okay. Yeah, yeah the, the, it's not trapped. That's 30. That's it's not what... trapped or locked, surprisingly enough. Okay, Kyron. Is that the first you one? You want to come? Is that the first door? It's the first door, yeah. I'm let's also just, investigating just, all three. I'm let's just investigate all three. Yeah. So, so three rolls. That's a twenty-three. Yeah, call ten. So twenty-three. Do I notice or anything about the second door? Uh, you okay? So you're uh, so you're walking in to investigate the second door. Right? You're walking down the hallway. Oh, oh, does okay. the door block the hallway? Yeah. <coughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I so, like, it's... That. Different it's, story. It's not three doors along the hallway. It's so, three doors, like, blocking, so you have to so use So we back the up. One at a time? And yeah. then... Oh, okay. Open the door with your mage hand while we're, like, all back away from it. <laughs> I love it. Very sure. carefully. I love it. <laughs> Okay. Unless you want to open it with your real hand. No. Okay. That's dumb. <laughs> Kyron yeah. opens it. I already with investigated the first one. Kyron opens it. It oh, swings open uneventfully. It does. Cool. Uh, perception check before you walk into the next area to make sure there's, or investigation to make sure there's no traps beyond the threshold of the door. And then an investigation no, on the next door. Okay, so give me an investigation for the uh, for the little hallway between that. Although, we're out of time. 
That is the call. So, <clears throat> we will call this here, I think. It's an interesting place to stop uh, in the middle of the hallway. Between trapped, potentially, or... Deadly doors. For yeah, some reason, I have a feeling the only thing. Jesse and Alex didn't have much to do tonight. Oh, they did. Well, I, I listened to Dave and his adventure of opening chests and doors and doors trying to die. I at least did something useful tonight. I don't have the ability to use Mage Hand, nor can I decipher traps. What I can do is I can shoot a bow really hard and I can sneak up oh, on yeah, anybody. Oh, no, yeah, as soon as we come to a monster, <laughs> you will be really important. It's literally my only purpose, that and severe sarcasm. Fucking shit up. And every now and then I solve puzzles, which none of us actually did tonight. Yeah. We, no. had eight. we solved shit up. zero we puzzles. There was eight puzzles. But we didn't solve it, we brute forced it. Yeah, we did. We literally got lucky walking That's right there was the right solving. No, it's not. How is it not? Well, there haven't been a lot of riddles either. Some of the shit you just have to figure out. Like giving all the gems to the gargoyle thing. Yeah. Um. I, I added where he says more so that you'll keep going. Of, like, catch the hint there. Yeah. I think we have some. <clears throat> but. So, is that the end? That's the end, everyone. Later. Good night. Bye, friends.